my name is Mr. Sunil Mamtora. I'm an ophthalmologist. That means I'm a doctor specialising in the care and treatment of patients with eye diseases. I work in the National Health Service, the NHS in the UK, and I currently work at the Bristol Eye Hospital. Well, no day is typical in the healthcare service in the hospital where we work, but when a patient attends the hospital eye service, they have their vision measured by one of our team and that will tell us how well the patient's seeing or how poorly the patient's seeing. Following that, the doctor will then see them and examine them using a microscope. We call that type of microscope that we use to examine patient's eyes a slit lamp. Ideally, we need a solution whereby every slit lamp has a camera system attached to it. We can record the consultation for every single patient and at subsequent visits, we can replay those consultations back in high resolution, but in 3D as well, because the slit lamp, the microscope that we use to examine all the patient's eyes is a 3D microscope. We use binoculars with one ocular giving an image to each eye, allowing us to view a stereoscopic 3D view of the patient's eye. COVID has taught us and shown us that digitalization of healthcare has so many benefits, and that's not just for the purpose of um, social distancing. It allows us to identify patients' needs better, triage them more appropriately so that the patients who need their care sooner receive it in a more timely fashion. So technology and digital visualization can really help with that because right now, we receive referrals from either GPs or optometrists in written form. They say, please see the following patient on an urgent basis with X, Y, and Z problem. How can we know what the problem truly is or when the patient really needs to be seen? We're a visual specialty in ophthalmology. Every decision we make is based on the examination that we perform through us seeing the patient's eyes directly on our own microscopes. If we can use digital technology in this way to have a real view of what was seen by the person who was referring the patient, we can more accurately and appropriately triage those patients to make sure that those patients are seen in the most appropriate place and timescale. So what we need is a glasses-free way of watching those 3D videos that we capture on the microscope in an accessible way. And that's why I'm really excited to see what the ACES Facial Lab screens can help us with in ophthalmology. Imagine if we could see what that examination was at the previous consultation, it gives us so much of a better understanding about how that patient's conditional disease has progressed and gives the clinician more confidence to make decisions, be it listing the patient for surgery or even having more confidence to discharge the patient, freeing up further appointment slots for patients who otherwise need to be seen. This would allow us to view the examination performed at previous visits. And I found that being able to show patients what their eye condition is, how it affects them in 3D and in such an immersive way helps to achieve a better compliance and also patient satisfaction too. And we know from many research studies that have been performed that when patients understand their condition better, when they're more engaged with their healthcare, they have better outcomes. In Bristol, we're well suited and well equipped to identify any problem that a patient might have with their eyes and to be able to provide the best quality treatment for them.